troops that the Russians were engaged in trying to uh, impact our election. Absolutely. No, it's not a hoax. Uh, Do you care about this hearing today? Not really, because I think that the Republican trying to cover it up for Trump. I think that's the basic of it. And the Democrat doesn't have enough power to, to impeach him yet. I, I don't see where I'm learning anything because some of the questions that they asked him, he refused to answer. So that's why I say it's a cover up. It matters, the simple fact that it's happening you know, says quite a bit as far as us paying attention to what we know has happened. And I think it's really important that not just the government does this job, but we as a people also take note and see that, you know, there's some official things that are happening and official concerns that we should also be paying attention to. I've learned not to expect anything you know you can't hope you got to get up and do something about it i hope really want to see something come out of this you know and as far as not just changing policies but us waking up and paying attention to the many ways that we can all be affected and swayed one way or the other and i think that a lot of it is a cover-up so it's kind of like the information that we hear from the hearing is kind of pacifying the public to keep the public suppressed of what's really going on to maybe keep them calm and avoid kind of any incidents of civil unrest. It should matter to everyone that's in the country, maybe even in the world, because I think there's a lot of corrupt officials throughout the world and different governments that are starting to use the social media to affect the outcome of different elections and affect the outcome of how the youth will react to future politics and politicians.